right now I have my summer vacation so that's almost eight weeks of vacation which is really nice however yeah I've been along a long time and if I still look a bit tired it's because it's because I just woke up but uh, a big box arrived the, that I ordered not that long ago a week ago or so I would guess uh, it's for a friend and I are planning a trip uh, to take our bikes to ride all the way to North Cap. So uh, I thought I would give this a try, even though it's a big, yeah, tent to carry around. It's so we will be camping a little on the trip, but. Uh, this is the box and right now I have a little helper running around somewhere. Right there. I'm not sure if you can see her. She's right there. <laughs> Trying to catch butterflies and eat grass and whatnot. Oh well. But uh, I ordered this to give it a try. Uh, there's been a bit of debate between my friend and I whether or not it's worth it. Uh, so I thought I would give it a try and give you guys my honest opinion. Simply because um, I still find it really hard to see, to tell if if reviews are genuine or if they're sponsored or anything like that. But I bought this this one out of own pocket. So if it's bad, I will let you know. Uh, hopefully, I don't hope it's bad, but. It is what it is. It's like you can always find the bad reviews if you look for them and you can always find the good reviews if you look for them as well. But uh, my friend dared to uh, to let me take make an unboxing and actually put it up in one go. I might speed up the process but uh, I will let you know what time it is once I... before I start. <laughs> She's... Either it's butterflies or shadows. She's a little crazy, but uh, yeah. So let let's get this one out of its box. So the reason I bought the toucan first off just to get a bit more room. So what comes in the box is simply this big burrito thing. So, I guess it's just a matter of trying to put it up now. I'll put you guys here. So I haven't, there wasn't any instructions in the box or anything like that. So I'm just gonna go with it. But I guess it's, these actually seem really nice, to be honest. Nice ones. Okay. Yes. Oh, yeah. Just so it's. I'm not sure if you guys can see. It's 10 for 48. So. Mm. Yeah. Nothing else in the box. Just. Oh, 
Here it is. Hopefully you guys are able to see. We just check to make sure. It sucks if you can't. Yeah, so they they hide all the poles and all that stuff. They hide it in the in the front of this. Right here and in a little pocket. Oh I should have brought a brought a knife. Maybe not. Let's see. Oh, <laughs> yeah, so these are actually bent from the company up to make the curve, I guess. So I do wonder a little why they haven't put any instructions in the... But I guess it's because they think it's self-explanatory or whatever it's called. So, I think... I think we'll just try and see if, if it really is that. <clears throat> I'm not sure. Yeah, you can see it right here. So they are made like this. So I guess that's very important whenever you put it together that you actually make sure they curve the right way. This one here. So needs to go through this one. Mm-hmm. 
все. So up until this point, right now it's 10.55. Uh, the only thing that I'm missing is to put these, these uh, clocks thing, these, I don't know what they're called, <coughs> nails. <coughs> nails in the ground. If I could get it out. So the while well, I fight this, so the reason the reason I bought this is just because I thought it would be nice that it's it's like a, Oh, I forgot something I can see. This one right here. Um, is that I would prefer not to have... So so the reason I bought this is, is quite simple. It's because it comes with all of it. It's like an all-in-one, if you will. And hopefully it's good enough. Um, so it's, I just think it's, even though it's quite big, when it's packed together, it's, it seems like a nice thing to mount on your bike. I will still have to, that, that will come in another video because I remember one of you guys were asking how much stuff you were able to put in those SW Motec the place uh, saddlebags so I thought I would put that in the same same video <coughs> so but right now I'm I'm not really caring that much about about uh, putting those plugs in even though it might be a good idea but I don't see why that's needed right now, but we can just put a few ones. In. So, no reason like this. So, these ones are actually quite long, as in really long. It's a good thing. And then we'll just tighten it up. Mm. So it doesn't really seem to be that heavy about staying where it is, but not. But uh, it's fine. So this one apparently came undone. That puts me in a very difficult position. <laughs> because I'm not Boy Scout. So yeah, we'll just do it like this. I could make a knot, but even though I'm pretty sure that you you guys will make fun of me anyway, so just like that. So 
uh, and also the reason I bought the two can is just because it would be nice with a little bit more space than what looks to be in the uh, in the uh, what's it called the other one the goose I guess. Just look, and also the quality seems really really nice. I will say that. So. So if I let my feet just barely touch that, there's still plenty of space actually. It's, it's hard to tell, but there's actually more space in it that, than, uh, than I, I thought there would be. And then we have a shiver and the uh, She's fighting shadows. And she's so occupied that that even if you say her name, she's she's too busy to focus on it. Twix? Come here. <laughs> yeah. She doesn't have the time. It's actually not that easy with one hand. There we go. So I think Oh yeah. So the only thing that I feel like I'm missing. It's actually a pillow. That's about it. But other than that, it seems nice. And I'm and this this night I am going to sleep in it just to try it out. To see how it is. But of course it's all a matter of finding finding some steady even ground <laughs> to sleep on. It's so funny to watch. It's so busy. Twix, come here, come here. <laughs> yeah, not time for it. Oh well. So uh, there will be a follow up in the same video. So it's just gonna continue from this point. But uh, now the tent is all set up, I guess. I could put more of those uh, nails in the ground, but it's not a very windy place I am right now uh, and the time ended up being 11.02 so I would say it's really easy to set up actually so that's that's really nice that's also the reason I bought it and also the fact that <clears throat> I I wouldn't of course you can get some really compact tents that's even bigger than this but it's not like I don't really feel like I need it though. So this is just gonna be fine I think. What's this? It's just like a oh some sort of ventilation. Thing. That's nice actually. And I will say it's it seems like the fabric they're using is really strong and durable. So up until this point I'm I'm happy with it, I will say. We have a little mattress. That's a part of our sleeping bag thing. But one thing that's really cool is that if if you choose, if you end up choosing that this uh, this mattress and sleeping bag is not enough for you, you can just take it out. So. That's that's nice. So, but uh, follow up. Oh, and a little pocket for your phone or so. Motorcycle keys. So that's cool. 
but it is actually quite quite big I'm not sure so if we plenty of room but I'll catch you guys tomorrow morning guys I just woke up so if I look like shit well that's just because that's how I look <laughs> um, night went well I will say that I didn't manage to find level ground to sleep on which made that I was sleeping on a little bump which just goes to tell that this mattress it's not the I wouldn't say it's the best uh, but I think if you find level ground with no rocks and stuff like that, I think you're good. But it's just... Yeah, so that's that's something I, I would have liked them to have made a little bit more out of. But I also know that it's a little difficult when you try to make it in like a combined solution. You can take... You can take the the mattress and the, the sleeping bag, so the sleeping bag is zipped to this. And the mattress, you can take that out if that's not, uh, if you don't find this good enough, which is a really good thing because I, th the tent seems to be really, really good. I will say that the, 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 mattress and the sleeping bag i think they they're good as long as you're in a really warm environment i will have to look up the temperatures for what it was this night because at some point it did feel a little cold not not an issue but it did feel it wasn't warm i would say it like that um, but you can take these out uh, which is a really good thing because the tent, I have no complaints about, it's actually really good and it's thought through and I really do like how simple and easy it is to set up. But if, uh, if Wingman of the Road were to improve on some stuff, I would say it would have to be the mattress and the, and the yeah, sleeping bag that zips to it. But other than that, everything went well, and I'm pleased with it. Uh, however, for the trip, I think I'll at least bring a blanket just to make sure. <laughs> yeah, but I will have to, but I will have to look up the temperatures for what it was this night. Um, yeah. So next up. Is it as easy to uh, pack together than it was to set up? Time will tell.
So one thing that I really think they could improve on is like giving you a little bag for these actually. No, oh, even one of them is bent. I don't think I did that, but yeah. So that would actually be helpful if they gave you a little bag, because right now where they are supposed to be is in this little pocket over here. It's quite a big deep pocket. So they will just be loose around that. That would be nice.
Not my best, best packaging job, but uh, it just went all right. I had a little help, so <laughs> that's what it is. Uh, but other than that, I'm actually really happy with the tent itself. However, I think for the climate that I will be using it for, I will have to come up with a solution either to put a blanket in you know, and roll it up together with the tent and all, which is possible. Or otherwise, uh, just get a separate sleeping bag, something that is a little warmer. Um, but uh, when the trip comes, you guys will be the first ones to know, but that's gonna be next year. Right now it's just a matter of getting, getting the, getting the some of the stuff that I need for the trip next year um, so that's what I'm doing right now but uh, other than that ride safe and take care guys I'll catch you in the next one